Wait, why would your phone camera blink? Even when you're not using it. Have you ever experienced this? Or maybe you know someone who has? Was it a glitch? A bug? A malfunction? Hmm, maybe. Or most likely, maybe not. Here's the uncomfortable truth. You're ready for it? Your phone's camera isn't always under your control. And smart people, cybersecurity experts, billionaires, whistleblowers, they're not taking chances. They are doing something you probably haven't done yet. Yes, putting tape over their phone cameras. Or let's just say, covering their cameras. And once you know why, you'll seriously consider doing the same. In this video, we're peeling back the layers on this quiet but growing trend and revealing why putting tape over your camera might be the simplest, smartest move you make all year. We carry our phones everywhere, in bed, in meetings, in bathrooms, during private calls, everywhere. That little lens staring at you from the front or the multiple ones on the back, they're high quality, ultra wide, autofocus, night vision capable, and they're always with you. Now imagine one of them is always watching, not recording, watching, not all the time, just when you're most vulnerable, changing, crying, whispering secrets, typing in passwords. Creeped out yet? Let's break it down. You download a fun, simple, innocent looking app, say a photo editor or even a QR scanner. It works fine. But what you didn't see is the hidden code buried inside. That app requested camera access when you first opened it, and you clicked allow without thinking. That's how malware gets in the back door. Now, that app can activate your camera. It can see, it can record, and on certain phones, it can do this without the little green dot ever showing up. That's right. The green dot isn't a law of nature, it's software. Software can be tricked, bypassed, or just ignored. Let's talk real life. Sir, drop your weapon, put your hands on your head, and get down on the ground. You are going to be placed under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. A post by Graham Cluley talked about how FBI agents arrested a man accused of hacking into more than 100 computers and using personal information stolen from them to extort sexually explicit videos of young women and teenage girls. He was apprehended by the authorities after a six-month-long investigation into his involvement in computer hacking, identity theft, and voyeurism. Computer forensics experts at the FBI claim that Majangos infected more than 100 computers being used by approximately by 230 individuals with spyware. At least 44 of the victims are said to be juveniles. Let's go back to that green light. On iPhones and newer Androids, a camera access dot shows up when the lens is active. But hackers aren't always playing by the rules. Some use a tactic called zero-click exploits. You don't click anything. It just happens. One such spyware, Pegasus was capable of activating your phone camera silently. No notifications, no dots, nothing. You see how the illusion of control breaks down? Let's get one thing clear. Covering your camera with tape is not high tech. It's low tech brilliance. No app, no setting, just a physical barrier. It blocks the lens. Even if someone hacks in, they'll see nothing but black. No screenshot, no surveillance. It's not elegant, but it's effective. Now, smart people don't rely on tape alone, but it's a first line of defense, a quiet signal that says, not today. Good point. Covering your camera protects what they can see, but what about what they can hear? You guessed it. Your phone's microphone is also accessible. And unlike the camera, there's no green dot for audio. Some may even use fake Siri activations or system processes to trigger the mic without your permission. So, the tape is a start, but what's your plan for the rest? You don't need to live in fear, but you do need to live informed. Here's what smart people do. 1. Cover your cameras when not in use, seriously. This might sound paranoid, but it's actually one of the simplest and smartest precautions you can take. 
Whether it's a piece of tape, a sticky note, or a proper slide cover, just block the lens. Because if it can't see you, it can't spy on you. 2. Audit your app permissions at least once a month. Go into your phone settings and check what apps have access to your camera, mic, location, and files. You'll be surprised how many have sneaked in permissions they don't need. Revoke anything suspicious or unnecessary. 3. Use phones that support hardware kill switches. Not all phones allow it, but privacy-first devices like give you the power to physically shut off your camera and mic. That's peace of mind no software patch can provide. 4. Delete apps you don't trust or rarely use. The weather app you installed six months ago that still asks for your mic access? Yeah, delete that. If you don't use it, lose it. Fewer apps equals fewer attack vectors. 5. Keep your OS updated, but don't blindly trust it. Updates patch known vulnerabilities, yes. But don't assume you're invincible just because you're on the latest version. Stay aware. Stay skeptical. 6. And most importantly, use cybersecurity tools that actually work in the background. Smart people don't wait for something to go wrong. They use tools that offer real-time threat monitoring, invisible threat detection, and proactive alerts, even against zero-day exploits like our Tilaris AI agents built for the exact threats we've been talking about. Want to see next-gen mobile protection in action? Request a demo of our Tilaris AI agents and discover how real-time threat detection work. We're not talking firewalls or antivirus pop-ups. We're talking intelligent monitoring that knows when your mic is active, when your camera is triggered, and when something's off even before you do. Privacy is no longer about if you're being watched. It's about what you're doing to stop it. Let Telerus do the watching for you. Smart people put tape over their phone cameras because they know what's at stake. And after today, you do too. If you learned something new, do me a favor. Like this video, subscribe to the channel and share this with someone who thinks they have nothing to hide. Because privacy isn't about hiding. It's about owning your space. We're Tealeris, showing you the smart way to stay private and protected. If you don't subscribe now, you may not see us again.